Hello and welcome to Emma Reads Reddit. Today I'm reading r slash shitty pro-life tips. I don't know if anyone else gets anxious about phone calls, but a little tip I've learned is, if there's a phone call that I don't want to make before I start dialing the number, I carefully hold the phone in my hand and toss it gently into a lake. I hope this advice helps others. If you're being chased by an animal, just lay on the ground for five seconds. The five second rule will prevent the animal from eating you. This morning I was working on something and made an interesting metaphorical observation. The cutting discs used on this rotary tool are very brittle. You can break them with your fingers. However, mounted on a spindle and spun at thousands of RPM, those same fragile discs can cut through steel. So the next time you're feeling weak or useless, consider that you may simply not be getting utilised properly and that your true potential awaits. Now go out there and spin really fast! Life hack. Avoid red lights by driving at 114,4827 miles per hour. This velocity will blue shift them enough to appear green. If you hate the beep noise the PS4 makes when it turns on, fire a gun at the same time of turning the console on. If you have high blood pressure, cut an artery open to relieve some pressure. Side effects may include loss of blood, loss of consciousness and death among others. Make sure you use sex after you pee or you'll get HDMI or something. Avoid having to wash dishes by smashing them on the floor. Don't patronise store restaurants with help wanted signs out front. They're understaffed and service is probably slow. Lonely? Drive around the neighbourhood in this and make tons of new kid friends. Leopards are huge fans of hide and seek. If you see one, you should run and yell, found you! When you're driving any vehicle at any turning, always turn to the opposite side to which your indicator is showing. Never let others predict your move, ever. Lock your dog and your wife in the trunk of your car for 10 minutes. When you open it, whoever is happiest to see you is the one who loves you the most. If your wife or girlfriend is mad at you, you should stand squarely, maintain eye contact, put up both hands so she can see your palms and say, calm down in a firm voice. Don't panic by toilet roll from lockdown 2.0. Leave your arse unwiped. The resulting stench will encourage others to observe proper social distancing or at least wear their mask over their nose. When you're in a public bathroom and want to take a silent dump, just place your hand below your butt and catch your turd and let it glide smoothly into the water. <laughs> in order to become immortal, marry someone you hate. This way, the time you spend together will feel like eternity. If you have a home insurance policy, you can microwave a penny for 10 minutes on high and get free money. If you want to keep your whole birthday cake for yourself, just sneeze the candles out. When your girlfriend is having menstrual cramps, explain to her, this is why we can't have a female president. If you eat an entire cake without cutting it, you technically only had one piece. Want to know what celebrity you look like? Become a serial killer and wait for Netflix to do a crime drama episode about you. If you want your dog to take a pill, 1. Get a piece of cheese, 2. Eat the cheese for energy, 3. Get ready to wrestle your dog. When asked what your birthday wish is, tell them that you wanted to die because if you tell someone your wish, it won't come true and now you're immortal. When reading to your kids before bed, intentionally yawn a number of times. This will cause them to yawn, allowing you to throw some Benadryl in their mouth so you can finally get some damn sleep. Want a girl's number? Make sure to hit her car. The best way to reconnect with people you haven't talked to since high school is to say you're open to multi-level marketing schemes. Slowly remove parts of your house, like a toilet tear and a wall there, and hide them away at a friend's house. That way, when you get divorced, only half of the house will be left standing and you'll get the half of that house. Therefore, you'll actually have three-fourths of a house. This is basic house math. Also, if you have a dog, start bribing him with bacon treats when you call his name. That way, when the dog has to choose an owner, he'll side with you. This also works for children, but substitute video games and ice cream for bacon treats. Also, start peeing on objects in order to establish ownership. See if there is a way that you can pee on bank accounts somehow. People often report they feel a chill when in the presence of a ghost. Save money on air conditioning by filling your home with haunted objects. Depressed? Change your Facebook birthday to tomorrow. You will have something to look forward to and all of the birthday wishes will cheer you up. Tired of running out of ice? Freeze shards of glass. 
They are reusable, look similar to regular ice, and you'll never have to lug home a bag of ice again. Cross your fingers behind your back while clicking I agree for website slash app terms of service. This way, you don't have to really agree to anything and you still get to use the app. If you have anxiety from thinking everyone secretly hates you, intentionally be a shitty person to everyone. That way, you know where you stand with everyone and you don't have to worry anymore. If you overstate your weight to a doctor and they didn't check themselves, you might get a higher dosage of drugs. Have restless leg syndrome when you're trying to sleep? Smoke heroin and you'll nod out before it can kick in. Addicted to prescription drugs? Post a fake prescription, a drug take back event. <laughs> if your building is on fire and you get chilly waiting outside for the fire department, go back in the building to warm yourself up. Save time on dishes by eating directly out of the fridge. Children can't annoy you if you lock them in the shed. Tinder is for rookies. Go to Facebook Marketplace and search for wedding dresses. It'll show you recently divorced females in your area. From there, you can filter by size. Sleeping until noon every day so I only have to pay for two meals. How to turn your depression into profit. Gym tip. Work out smart, not hard. A lot of people at the gym go and lift the big weights, but actually, the small weights are lighter and much easier to lift. Remember, Taking the vegetables off your double bacon cheeseburger decreases the amount of calories consumed. If you stain a shirt, you can simply outline the stain with a sharpie and give it a name. This will make it seem like you visit islands. Not eating all day so that you can get drunk off two beers. It's called financial health. Look it up, idiot. Deer population is controlled by releasing wolves into an area. All problems should be solved that way. Too much pollution? Release wolves in factories. Dislike Congress? Wolves. Want to lose weight? That's right, wolves. If you really want to piss someone off when introducing them, make little finger quotation marks in the air when announcing their job title. Glue a tiny mirror over the picture of you on your driver's license so when you hand it to the police they get confused and arrest themselves instead. Me, can I drink alcohol in this medication? Doctor, but one drink is going to feel like you've had four. Me, oh, so I'm saving money. Cutting your tennis balls in half allows you to store two more balls in each can, saving space. On death row, ask for McDonald's ice cream as your last meal. You'll never find a working machine and you'll get to live. Bring cocaine to the airport so you can pet the dogs. Deal alert! Aldi has shopping carts for 25 cents. I just bought 40 for $10 and took them directly to the scrapyard where I got paid 7.5 cents per pound for a net profit of $290. Hashtag winning. <laughs> if someone tells you that they're fighting depression, be sure to tell them to cheer up. Maybe they haven't thought of that yet. OMG, cute date idea. Go donate blood together and save six lives collectively and then buy a six pack of wine coolers to share and get absolutely black out for $8 due to disproportionate blood to alcohol level. Lol. Only a fool would buy IKEA furniture. Instead, I just download the instructions and keep emailing their service department to say that I am missing a piece until they ship me all the pieces over a six month period. If you're behind someone at the ATM late at night, let them know you're not a threat by giving them a gentle kiss on their neck. <laughs> Thank you for watching this video. If you enjoyed what you have heard, please like, subscribe and hit the notification bell so you never miss any of the daily content from Emma Reads Reddit.